showdown on our hands. Make the board black. This is the part. <sighs> belt, belt. Um, probably playing. I'm probably playing dragons again. It's gonna be a. It's gonna be a dragon stream because I need to climb. I, I can't be stuck in diamond for more than two days. That's just. That's just way too embarrassing. Oh, I should have picked up Zach. What am I doing? I'm actually down for Knife's Edge. Because I'm probably playing Rengar this game. Agreed? Oh, I don't know why I'm not playing Aphilios over that guy. My bad. You should have drawn the chemical structure for glucose for us to understand. Huh? Fuck. If I played Aphilius, I would have won. Had any Anomzi as well? What am I doing with this shit? Oh, as in I could have played it? <clears throat> but I have Belt Belt. Belt Belt's kind of hard to play a uh, thingy with. Unless I just Warmog Zack and then high roll my item here. Maybe it could have been Dragon Mancer game. But then again, like everyone and their mums are playing Zack. I mean, there's no way I'm winning this round, right? I'm kind of down to just pre-level. Or just make 20 if I win, accidentally. Which I'm probably not. <clears throat> I'm down to just play Rengar, get my free top 4, and get out of here. Sword, I am down for sword. I'm slamming Zeke's. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure the uh, the Aphelios comp might be back in meta. Why am I not double Zeke'sing my Rengar? Am I trolling? No, if that was a spat, I win the game. Fuck. I mean, it's always Hodge Rengar. No matter what. Unless I get, like, Earth's Grab Bag. Fuck, I shouldn't have slammed, because I could get Earth's Grab Bag here. Earth's Grab Bag's really good. He removed it because he was annoyed. No, the one that annoys me is Weirge. Weirge annoys me, and, uh, the other one. The other condescending one. Was it okay? I think it was okay. Yeah, it might have been okay. That is the most disgusting thing I've seen in my life. A random Graves? Another Graves? I have a fucking Graves too. <clears throat> I lost with Graves too. He got targeted by Ezra first. I lost with Graves too. Hanini and Omzi. Wanna see a fireball? There is no way this is the board. I 
really need this bow though. I mean this BF. <coughs> Alright, I'm just gonna go 7 then. And then I'm not playing Rengar. I didn't expect to hit a Graves. Of all things, a Graves on 7 is unheard of. Do I need this bow? Yes. I need this bow. I need, uh, I need Eon. My Eon's gone. They'll probably just do IE. IE Hodge, but am I selling Rengar? There's no way I'm selling Rengar. But I could win streak for 10 years with, uh, Graves 2. With IE Hodge. <clears throat> and I just need to level and play Nomzi. <coughs> play love uh level to seven, play Nomzi and it's Nomzi plus that guy. Who's the other cannoneer? Oh Zeri, Zeri. And I just have six cannoneer. I mean I kinda fucked this game by trying to play Rengar. Yeah, I just go 7, level, play this guy, and then look for Zeri. I mean, Zeri can't be hard to find. <clears throat> Everyone's so mad. Bro, it's just OC death. It's fine, don't worry about it. I'm just not sure how, uh... I'm not sure how this comp's gonna do into dragons, because I haven't I haven't played this at all since it um since the patch came out. Or even like two patches ago. Iron body, No shots, there's no Zeri. <clears throat> I mean, Hecarim sucks now, because Hecarim, Hecarim doesn't cast with uh, Vow anymore. He has to like auto attack a billion times. When do you play dragons? Uh, when you get like a AP start. So AP starts generally look like uh, Kai'Sa Demancer with Guardian Frontline or Bruiser, depending on what you have. Lagoon gives you money. Um, and then yeah, Kai'Sa just takes you fast nine. Also, I just realized I don't have Lost Whisper. I can just go 8 for... I don't know. Oh, I can just go 8 for another Graves. <clears throat> and I really need my Last Whisper ASAP. And I'm rolling 2 items at a time, so I'll get Last Whisper guaranteed. So I think gives Graves Whisper, which procs the 80 stacking for each pellet and cannoneer proc. That's actually... I'm pretty sure that got patched. I do remember reading something about it. Like, there was a bug. Oh, I do. I do remember. There was a streamer who had Deja 3, and then the Whisper Graves with Siphon one-shot his entire board. I do remember that. There was a clip. And the guy was so pissed. But that was before the patch. I, I didn't watch the box box clip, but I know what happened to uh to someone. Belt Nomzi for Morello. Is she able to proc it? No, 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 I need to- I need to prioritize- No, you're right, you're right. Because I'm getting- it's carousel next round, so I'm guaranteed to get a uh, glove. And you really need anti-heal in this meta. If you don't have anti-heal, you're- you're just dead. Uh, I need to go- I need to go 8 for either a Graves or another Zeke's. So another... Rengar, I guess. Okay, this game is too high roll. 
I actually high rolled so hard. My god, Graves? Is this comp broken again? Oh no. Okay, to be fair though, it's 4 5. I have Graves 2, best in slot every single unit. Like, this is turbo high roll. A relationship where you move in. When you're my age, 23. 23 is pretty young to be, like, moving out. As an Asian. Because I know in Asian households, it's very common to not move out until you're, like, 27, 28. Or something. Really? I'm taking Deathblade? I was looking for some, like, utility. <clears throat> Just hire a girlfriend who loves TFT as well. Honestly? I don't know if I'd want my girlfriend to play TFT. Like, I don't think it'd be a, I don't think it'd be a good thing. Cause like, actually, I wouldn't really mind. Actually, that's a good thing, cause we have something in common. We have like a common interest. That's not bad. But obviously, I don't see like behind the scenes, right? <clears throat> like all I see is like them in public. So I wouldn't really know what's happening, or like the bad sides of a relationship. But I feel like if I ever got a girlfriend, I'd be the biggest simp. If you don't uh, have anything else in your life, relationships are great. But if you work a lot or just have a lot of hobbies that make you happy with yourself, it's just a pain. That's the thing. I play volleyball on the weekends. And it's like, it's something I look forward to every week. So I don't get like bored or like lonely. Okay, I might get a bit lonely sometimes. But like I play volleyball with friends. Saturday, Sunday, Monday. And I feel like that's plenty. Like, I don't need more. Gage? No, like, say, say, like, you're dating Cristiano Ronaldo. <clears throat> like, at least, I'd at least play, like, a bit of soccer. You know? It's like, if you're dating a TFT play a streamer and TFT is their life, then you'd kind of play it, no? That's what I'm worried about though. But here's the weird thing. People around me have told me that it's actually possible. It's possible to like get in relationships where you have nothing in common. Like it's a lot more common than you think. And I just can't think of it like ever working. My god, this Graves. Dude, is Graves broken? Dude, this comp's back. Everyone thought this comp was gone. Do I just play a, uh, a second Graves? Uh, the thing is, I don't have much to add at 9, so I'm just going to roll for Graves 3. Because I'm pretty sure Graves 3 wins me the game. Graves 3 isn't feasible. I think it is, with 100 gold. I'd rather play for win than play for 9. Because, like, what am I adding at 9? Because I, I have a dead rel in right now. I can also go Nom Z3. I skipped Nom Z. Fuck.
Uh, I want to put this on like a cheap unit. <clears throat> Bro, this graves. Holy shit. Depends on what you want from a relationship. If both of you are fine with just sitting in a room knowing you have someone there, it works. Okay. I know a lot of like... I know a lot of couples do that. And they call it uh, Netflix and chill. But I think I'm more of an outside person. I'd much rather just like go out and do stuff. <clears throat> why am I playing Rengar over Knife's Edge? Over why am I playing Rel over this? Why do I keep trolling? Uh, any graves? Oh, I really need Shroud for this guy. I think it's the Shroud do anything against Asol. I don't think it does. But you only play TFT. What? No, no. Wait, what? In order for this to work, I needed a Graves 3. Or like a second Graves 2. Uh, there's a problem with my board against this guy. It's that I have to clump. Just because I want the Zeke's value. Oh, we won the fight this time. I really want to kill him now. But I can't. He's 25. Why am I playing Sedge? Sedge is the fakest unit I've ever seen. <coughs> you also have Kevin? He thinks he's going to the mall with his girlfriend is what he wants to do? No, I'm talking about like... Dude, I don't fucking know. I don't know what I'd do with my girlfriend. But it's definitely not sit in a room and do nothing. I just got out of work, now show me that big kebab, you bad boy. Huh? So how much armor does Guardian give? It just gives you a shield? I don't need the Last Whisper then. But, I don't know. I don't know if Nomzi's gonna win me the game. Nomzi 3. That Double Graves 2 would definitely win though. I've got a Nico. What's up, Maddo? <clears throat> oh, this is nice. Oh fuck, I'm wrong side. Pretty sure like what this guy's playing is one of those like uh it's one of those like Exodia comps. <clears throat> it reminds me of uh this comp reminds me of Noble uh Knight's Kale. 
You just have like one carry in the back, and then you just have infinite frontline, which are like one two costs. I was thinking about playing Kiana just for more damage, and I get the stun as well. But then I lose, uh, how much HP? I lose 130 HP on each unit. Oh, bet we won. <laughs> what the fuck is this Aesol aiming at? Oh, 1-1-1. One, one, one. Let's go. Without playing dragons? You guys stop sending it? Fuck!